What's up, everybody? Welcome to uh, Cooking with Charlie Mac. I done already started on this chicken, you know what I mean? We finna go ahead and get this thing going, get it nice and, you know, flavorful. We doing the seasonings right now. You gotta make sure that the chicken is up for the challenge. Oh, 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 oh. that's the deep ass coochie hole, but whatever. We see how it's nice and seasoned. You wanna stretch it out after you season the front so that you can get the crevices. It's like me when I take a shower, I gotta stretch so I can get to between the rows. I do the chicken. I mean, now that it's nice and um and uh you know stretched out, now I can get the inside of these places. We got some of this salt and herb going on here. Look, got to get it all up in there, good. Get it in there, good, good, good. Oh, whew. then hit it with some of this little Montreal chicken, John. I mean, ah, this. don't want to use too much. Cause I just used a lot already. And then. I'm just one of them massages in the chick. You gotta you got a massage and treat it tender. Like a woman, I mean, you gotta the rubber just the right way. Perfect. Get all the stretch that yeah, baby, like that. Yeah. I felt the crack how you know you're doing the, the right way. Then after you're done with this side, flip that mug over. Look at that. Now you're on your back, baby. Hit him back with some more of that Montreal Jean. I mean, yeah. Get it nice and good, nice and good. You gotta have every bite be flavorful. I mean, the Tennessee whiskey rub right there, that should be fire. Whew. Yeah, buddy, yeah, buddy, yeah, buddy. Go ahead, go ahead. Stretch it out for daddy. Mm hmm. Hit him with a dash of that spicy jalapeno. Y'all know nothing about that? But you'll never know. Uh oh. You don't need too much of that, just enough to coat it. What else? what else? Oh, of course a minced onion. Definitely need that minced onion. Put that up in there real good. Some of that pink salt and spice. Then you massage this shit in there. Massage this shit in there. Good. Yeah, baby. Gotta get in there real good. Real nice, nice and tight. So y'all ain't know I can cook this, y'all. You ain't, you ain't know, you ain't know this. You ain't know I was gonna cook you. I caught this chicken myself. I walked down the street, and I'm just sitting in somebody's backyard in the cage. <laughs> so I got, got that motherfucker. So it's real good. Now we're gonna. Put some stuff in the coochie hole right there. I want to wash my hands. Get all the access off. I'm ashy, I know. Please don't, don't judge. Now, some of my food cooking skills may be a little unorthodox. You know what I mean? But it gets the job done. We put, a, put stuff inside of this mother. I like some... Uh, some bell pepper, I mean jalapeno peppers right here. Some sweet bell peppers. And of course, the crowd favorite, the uh, onion. So let's go ahead. I may have taken beat my phone. I don't even know how much battery I got. But anyway, we could get to cutting up this stuff. Stuff the chicken. Have the chicken right here, ready to be stuffed. Now, you can get a bunch of different type of jalapenos, but I like these. They give it a different type of flavor. You know what I mean? I want you guys to see the choppage. You got a uh, nice thin piece. You know what I mean? Uh, make sure you go all the way through. It's a nice knife. You want it to be real nice and real good and real fine. Make sure them edges is on point. Hmm, about three more should do it. Hmm. 
Excuse my little light. I, I broke my uh, phone, so it's a lot of extra glare in the camera. But you can see what's going on here. And this is own personal recipe. I just made it up and I'm going. But just know, it's about to be fine. As a matter of fact, three is enough. We're not going to do this last one. We're going to get some uh, the sweet bell peppers out now. Just a handful. Don't need too much. See how small they are? This chicken's gonna be nice and spicy. So if you don't like spicy chicken, then you better go to McDonald's or some shit and get a regular mix chicken. Cause this shit is gonna be on point. For real. Y'all ain't even know I was Chef Homeboy ID, did y'all? Think I got this big by not knowing how to cook? Shit. You get fed by knowing how to cook and not sharing. So, I don't share either. This whole chicken is for me. Okay, maybe not all of it, but I'm definitely getting a couple bites. Right, this would be the best chicken muffins ever tasted in their life. And if my phone go dead before y'all see me get to the onion, then just know the onion's going in there as well. I need at least two more. Do 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 do. Need some salsa music. Hey. Y'all ain't like to move like that, did y'all? Hey, Rita! On the shit. Food Network, y'all need to give me a show. Y'all call them and tell them how let your boy Charlie Mack to go rinse this off real quick. All right. Now what I like to do. Cut off both edges. I'm gonna use this whole onion. Cut off that. And cut off that. It makes it easier to peel. My onion is attractive. I guess you would say it's appealing. <laughs> Got to get it right. Get <laughs> they out there laughing at me in the garage, but it's fine. Left all the way to the bank. Is that my car? That nigga moving my truck. See, this onion is appealing. Didn't I say it? Get it? <laughs> you here getting freaky with the chicken? I read the, the, yes, a little bit. But it's only for flavor, not sexual. Why your nipples hard then? Don't judge me, dude. Ah! Your okay. headlights is on. Cause it's dark. What's this? Cooking with Mac? Yep, yeah, you know it. Welcome to the next episode. Shit finna be nasty as hell. See, Mo always gotta come here hating on something. Look at her. 
Look at her. Mo ain't never turned down a plate in her life. How you know? Everybody know. I'm going to turn down that plate. I guarantee you won't. It's like button crayon. <laughs> <laughs> now you get the onions. You want them nice, nicely sliced, you know. You don't want them too big, but you don't want them too small either. Now, it actually looks very good. Yeah, it's very appetizing, you know. It does look appetizing. You want to break these onions up, you don't want to put them in their hole, you know. So you got to get them out nice and going, you know what I mean. It ends in a moment. Please, don't rush perfection. These onions got to get nice. We want to um, we want to mix them all together. Listen, don't tell me that's enough. I'm the cook here. I know what I'm doing. Onions are very delicious, and they're good for you. Okay. Women always want to come in the kitchen and try to tell the true chef what to do. I'm gonna tag you in the video. Yeah. <laughs> My eyes are a little running right now. That's fine. That's, that's completely expected. <laughs> I, I can't see nothing. Okay, that's cool though. There is about enough onions right there. Listen, he, he please back up away from the chef. Now, what I like to do is to mix them all up. Listen. Stay away from my, my masterpiece here, okay? I'm sweating now because y'all making me nervous. Back up. Let me, let me do what I'm doing, okay? Y'all ain't got nowhere to be? Now, I like to mix everything up real good. You know? Get everything nice and put together. And then we're going to season the onions and the bell peppers. You got to season everything. Listen, let me do what I do, okay? I know what I'm doing. Can you find yourself somewhere to go? Please, you make me sweat. I'm hot. I'm trying to cook. Can you use the pit bull and take it outside? Come on. Damn. People always got something to say. Now never let them hate you. Stop your dream. Bro. <laughs> now, I like to put a little Italian seasoning, you know, just... Not not a lot, just you know a taint for taste. You know what I mean? Cause I'm I'm very good on, on the leaves. I'm good on the leaves. We gotta hit some parsley. Uh, yeah, buddy. Oh, that looking good already. Okay, let's see what else. And just to keep going with the the same theme of being hot and spicy. We're going to put a little taint of uh, Nashville uh, hot chicken seasoning on here. Yeah, buddy. That's looking real good. It's coming out real good, everybody. Now, we want to get it nice. Get it nice. Yeah. Yeah. I don't dice the onions, little girl. Okay? You want them to be big. Now, we're going to stick it all in the chicken booty. Let's bring it over here so you can see the chicken booty. You see the chicken booty? Yeah, we're going to put it in there. Yeah. It's going to be nice. You got to get it nice and packed in there because you want the flavor to sear through every, every bone or every bite. Okay, I cut, I cut up too much. But, that's still fine. It's still going to be delicious and we can use this extra shit for something else. Better than too much than not enough, I always say. This is chicken. Huh? Alright, we got it nice and um stuffed. 
So now you guys, I'm gonna put it in the oven and I'm gonna show you the finished results. See you in a minute. Still juicy. That's how you're supposed to have it. Now that's how you make a chicken. That looks good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>